These are lovely ostrich ferns. Hey, what's that? Yellow. The stuff. yellow thing's right. Uh -oh. Ferns will not have flowers. Instead, they'll put up sporophytes, which will be making spores inside of them. And so spores will act like seeds in terms of allowing the plant to disperse somewhere else and grow up somewhere else. It looks like over here there are a lot of baby ferns. Yeah, thousands and thousands. Oh, yeah, look at all those little those baby ferns. Those must have been from like last year. Right. Ferns, then, are usually an indicator of moist habitat. So a lot of rain happens around here. And if you look at the shorter cabbage-like plant that is underneath them, that's skunk cabbage. Another indicator and of moist land. That's exactly right. Skunk cabbage lives in wetland areas as well. And it'll look like a little purple tent when it first comes up, just as the snow is melting. But then as it, and that's where the flower is, the flowers are on a little ball inside that little purple tent. And then as you um, wait over the weeks, the big leaves will grow out of here. And if you broke one of these leaves, woof, it really does smell like a, a skunk, which is how it gets its name.